guys! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's me, Shane Mendoza. And for today's video, I'm going to show you on how to create and conduct ICT-based classroom quizzes using Kahoot application. Yes, tama ka, Kahoot application. Kung ngayon mo lang narinig, let me define you first. What is Kahoot? According to my research, when we say Kahoot, Kahoot quiz is a series of questions with between two to four multiple choice answers to choose from. Teachers can create their own quizzes, duplicate and edit others created and shared by other teachers, or simply play Kahoot's created by other users. So, yun po kapag sinabing Kahoot, and mind you guys na napakaganda at napakadali lamang pong gamitin ng Kahoot application. So, without further ado, let's get started. From Google, sa search box, let's click or type kahoot.com and then click enter. So, ayan. And then, let's click sign up. Since, gagawa pa lang tayo ng account ng kahoot. Choose your account type. Let's choose teacher. Describe your workplace, school. So, ayan. Uh, by this time, magsasign up tayo using my Google account. But, make sure na kapag magsasign up ka kayo using your Google account, make sure naka-sign in na kayo. Mismo dun sa Google para dera-derecho na lang siya. Okay? So, let's choose sign up with Google. And then yan, welcome to Kahoot. May lalabas na name, but optional lang din. Same as username, optional lang din. And school name, but sa name, ang itatype ko is Teacher Shane. But it's up to you kung anong gusto nyong ilagay. And sa school name, it's up to you din kung, anong gusto, kung ilalagay nyo ba yung school nyo. Okay? Then save and continue. So ayan, basic pro premium. Pero syempre, in this tutorial, no, gagamitin natin yung Kahoot. Syempre ng free. Doon sa taas na yun, ayan, sa basic, we can click the continue for free. But, punta tayo sa baba, pwedeng i-click din natin yung continue for free din. Ayan. Ayan, waiting lang tayo ng konti. And then, ayan, nandiyan na tayo sa home or parang timeline ng kahoot. And then, Ayan, sa taas may mga tab, Home Discover Kahoots and Reports. But, we will click yung tab. So, ayan. Click doon sa baba yung Create New. Pero, doon sa upper right corner, ayan, doon sa taas, we can click Create. And then, ayan, mamimili tayo. So, Kahoot for formative assessment, get to know your teacher, but since we can create tayo, let's click create. And mind you guys, in this tutorial, is 5 po yung sample ng question na gagawin natin. So, ayan, sa time limits, let's click 20 seconds. And sa points, may 0, uh, 1,000, and 2,000 tayo, but we will choose 1,000. And then, sa answer options, single select tayo. Since free po yung uh, Kahoot na account na gagamitin natin. And mind you guys, kapag quiz po yung kinilik natin, multiple choice po ito. Okay? So, let's type the questions. Na questions. Ayan. What is the secret of delightful pastry? What is the secret of delightful pastry? So, ayan. May mga... Uh, pwede tayong ilagay na choices. Filling, ingredients, and again guys, mind you na kung correct answer, yan, i-click lang yung circle, then check. Kung correct answer ha. 
Yan, pie, pie crust and pressed cookies. Ayan. And also, we can add photo. Ayan. Let's go to the image library. And yun, may mga free categories. Hanapin natin yung food and drinks. Since related sa food, yung topic natin na ginagawang quiz. Hanap tayo ng related sa baking. Ayan. Sa mga baked products. And pwede tayo mag-add ng photos. Then, add ulit tayo ng question. Yan sa left side. Then, yan quiz. True or false yan yung meron tayo sa free version. Then, quiz ulit. Type ulit tayo ng question. Again, guys, uulitin ko kapag quiz, yung pinili natin, multiple choice yung type ng question. And which of the following... is referred to as small flat sweet cake. Yan, ganun pa rin yung time limit, yung points and at answer options natin. And mag-type na tayo ng choices. Biscuits. Muffins. Cookies. Guys, pag correct answer, click lang natin yung circle. Kapag yun yung correct answer. Next, add ulit tayo ng question. So, yan. Type lang tayo. And what type of flour is commonly used in baking cookies? Lagay na tayo ulit ng choices. All-purpose flour. Again, kapag correct, yun yung correct answer, i-check lang natin yung circle. Mag-add pa tayo ng ibang choices. Yan, all-purpose flour, bread flour, cake flour, and cassava flour. And question na ulit tayo, but this time, gamitin natin yung true or false. Ayan, hanap lang tayo ng question. So, ayan, pastries. Our shortened flour products characterize mainly by their flakiness and tenderness so, ayan. Is it true or false? Kung true yung tamang sagot, check lang yung circle. Ayan. Then, again, let's add the last question. True or false? Pa din. Ayan. Correct answer is false. Then, kung tapos na tayo, let's click done sa upper right corner. Then, ayan, lagay natin yung title. Lagay natin is Baking 101. And yung description is optional lang po. But lagyan natin siya ng answer the following questions. It's up to you kung gusto nyo maglagay ng description. Let's click continue. Ayan, pupunta siya sa home. And para makita nyo yung ginawa nyo or ginawa natin, dun sa taas punta tayo sa tab ng kahoots. Ayan. Then let's click uh, play. So, may pagpipilian tayo dyan. Teach is for virtual classroom. Kung Zoom, via Zoom, or uh, Google Classroom yung gagamitin nyo, or you can choose a sign for self-paced learning. But ngayon muna is, try natin yung for virtual classroom. So, sa part na to, is 
Ang ipapakita ko sa inyo, syempre, is yung sa screen ng teacher. Yan. Pwede kayong mamili kung classic or team mode. Pag classic, individual lang. Syempre, pag team mode, groupings. Syempre, gustong gusto natin palagi yung individual. Classic. Diba? So, yan. And then, yan, ready to join. May lalabas po na game pin. Yung game pin na yan, yung ibibigay natin sa student natin. Okay? Pwede i-copy-paste mo na lang. Send sa kanila. Yan yung game pin na gagamitin ng student. Ayan, may nag-add na. Na player sa Aira. Well, let's say, nandun na lahat ng students. Click na natin. And mind you guys na uh, sa part na to is against uh, sa screen to ng teacher. Nasa kanya yung control. Okay? Ayan, may timer. Wait lang ng teacher yung sagot ng student. Ayan. So, the correct answer is ingredients. Yung color uh, pink yung sinagutan niya. Mali. Mali yung sinagot ni Ira. Makikita doon. Then, next lang ni teacher. Okay. 2 of 5. So, ayan. Wait lang ni teacher magsagot yung player or yung student. Ayan. Tama yung sagot ni student or ni player. Ayan. Then, next lang ulit ni teacher. Makikita yung score ni student. Ayan. Question number 3. Wait lang ni teacher. Yung sagot. Ayan. Tama yung sagot ni student. Then, si teacher, kiklik yung next. For the next question, makikita yung scoreboard. Ayan. True or false na. Second to the last question. So, wait lang ng sagot si student. Then, click next. So, sorry po kung hindi ko mapakita dito yung uh, screen ni student. Ayan, last question. Yun, correct answer ni student. Then, click lang yung Next. So, ayan. Since si Ira lang po yung player, yan, 4 out of 5, isa lang yung mali niya. Para makita yung feedback ni teacher, pindutin niya lang yung get feedback and then makakareceive si student ng feedback and sasagutan niya yun. So, pag nasagutan na ni student yung feedback na yun, si teacher, ikiklik yung uh, show feedback. Ayan. So, learning, feelings, or rating 5. And then, i-click ni teacher yung uh, view report kung gusto niya makita yung result. Lahat nung uh, answer nung quiz nung bata. So, ayan. Well played. Makikita doon yung player si isa lang. Ilan yung question? Five. And then, ayan. sa so, players na tab. After ng summary, makikita dyan kung ilan yung player. And yung sa question, ilan yung question. Yan, makikita din po dyan. And yung feedback ng bata. So, kung gusto nyo magkamero ng copy ng report, you can click report options, then download report. So, pwede nyo siyang i-download. Okay? So, ayan. Then, balik ulit tayo dun sa kahoots. Next na natin yan. And then, ayan. Kung gusto nyo, ngayon naman ipapakita ko sa inyo yung for self-paced learning or assign. Ano yung itsura nun? Okay? So, meron po dito pwedeng maglagay ng schedule si teacher kung kailan pwede or hanggang kailan dapat masagutan. Okay? Question timer on. Randomize answer order i-on natin. And then, let's click create. Okay, sa part na to is ipapakita ko sa inyo yung itsura nung uh, screen nung bata gamit ang cellphone. Okay? So, ayan. Paano natin may invite yung bata or yung player? So, click lang natin yung copy URL. Ayan. Yung may highlight. And other ways to share sa Twitter, Facebook, ayan, Google Classroom. Pwede din natin i-share. Ayan, sa cloud, sa email. And then, pinakamadali na i-share is game pin. Ayan, i-copy-paste lang din natin yan, then bigay natin sa bata, okay? Para magka meron sila o makita nila yung link nung quiz. Ayan, ito na, pinapakita ko na sa inyo yung itsura 
nung uh, quiz sa bata gamit ang cellphone. Yan, bata yung nagsasagot siyan. Okay, again, screen po yan ng cellphone. Diba kung mapapansin nyo, kapag self-paced, kita ng bata lahat, ba diba? Kasama yung question, tsaka siya din yung nagko-control. Pero kapag dun sa virtual, nakay-teacher yung control. Yun yung pinagkaiba nila. Ayan. And then, ayan. Pagtapos na, click natin ulit yung players. Kung gusto natin makita kung ilan yung players, yan iisa si Stella. And ang final score niya is 4,026. Correct answer, 80%. And kung gusto natin makita ulit yung grade niya or i-download, yun, download report lang natin. Ayan then, that's all. Okay? Ganun lang po kadali. So, yun, tingnan natin yung three dots na yun. So, may edit, rename, or share, duplicate, delete. So, sa share, pwede nating i-share yung quiz na to sa may Kahoot user na, okay? Sa Kahoot user na, pwedeng i-type lang natin yung name niya, okay? Or pwede nating i-share itong quiz na to through link, okay? Copy lang din natin. Or sa Twitter, kung anong social media, or uh, Google Classroom, okay? So, ayun lamang po. Uh, yun po yung steps kung paano gumawa ng quiz gamit ang Kahoot application. So, kung gusto nyo po na uh, mag-tutorial ako kung paano i-share to sa Google Classroom, just comment down below. Okay? That's all for today's video, guys. Hoping po na may natutunan kayo sa video tutorial na ito. So, if you like this video, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and click the notification bell for more updates. See you on my next video. God bless!